Okay, welcome everyone. Let's will start a second lesson, a third lesson on enterprise and entrepreneurship. So today we're supposed to cover our last learning outcome, which is be able to develop a business plan. So all about the business plan, how we can make the business plan and uh, why business plan is important for new businesses and uh, making good business plan is a crucial or very essential either you if when you planning to start your business so we need business plan and if you want to get the loan from the bank always bank or the financial institution will ask you provide us business plan so business plan you know you need to be look around different uh, elements within a business plan which will go through a lot of companies charge you a lot of money for it to preparing the bar uh, making the business plan for it i'll show you a couple of templates a couple of the old business plan you know will help you to prepare your own business plan so all the ideas whatever the business is you uh, whatever the idea of business you have you can uh, put on the paper and make a plan how you will when you will start when you will um initially plan planning permission for support depends nature of the business you know so all elements you need to then is a marketing plan how you will market your product or the businesses or the services in our organization what sort of the elements you need to look around which will go through what because you make a plan but there is a no control so it's very difficult to monitor the performance of the, your business so that's why control is a very cru crucial element with business plan so which will go through as well so quite mixed you know when you look in the inductive contents for this unit you've been we will given as a business or marketing plan so marketing definition we can look around target market segment marketing mix so all this come under the marketing plan when we look the uh business plan so in the business plan we are looking overall business plan like exact summary we in purpose and the summary proposition uh so what we need to what we're supposed to do so all this you know which we'll discuss these uh, uh elements within our discussion as well all this in these inductive contents you know all will be in our discussion so let's we'll go through and we'll start uh lesson now so my name is anjum satar today we are doing uh, lesson three those are listening this uh, recording so please just drop me email if you have any question and my email is there so let's you know we'll start what do we know about marketing plan uh, and the business plan what is the key difference between them any thought well marketing plan is the plan no the business plan is the plan the business a marketing plan is a plan, the marketing element of the business. Brilliant. Well done. So marketing plan is overall plan for business, which can become all elements of business. It can be marketing plan as a within a business plan. It can be production plan. It can be HR plan. Every overall plan is a business plan. So marketing plan is a one element of business so which is marketing plan of course business plan is a whole business and marketing plan is just regarding the business the marketing activity within the business plan so which will go through okay good so be able to develop a business plan that's all our learning outcome which we're supposed to learn i divide discussion according to your assessment criteria which is we supposed to be 4.1, 4.2, and 4.3. We have three assessment criteria. Develop a business plan for a new business. So we're supposed to be develop a little business plan, and uh, which we need to. And if you want to develop your own business plan, which we need to, I'll send you templates as well. Within that template, we can fill it. So what we can do? Uh, anybody heard about B business plan website? No okay so i'll show you which is quite good in term of sometime you know the clients carry on coming and asking you make business plan for us be business plan dot co dot uk there are number of uh, if you open there and you will find a lot of business plans <coughs> so we can look around
different business plans, sample business plans, all that. So there are the templates as well. There are some business plans, which I'll show you some simple business plan. So like a business plan is about restaurant, cafe and bakery, medical services. Maybe we're looking business plan for accountant. So when we'll click there, so we can find business plan. So if we look at some business plan, so like software, like accounting and book business, keeping business plan. So is their business plan is executive summary there and business sales, gross margin and net profit with we are expecting objective mission key a success which business will measure the performance against so so we can look around the ownership company history and we can give yes all in so please go through these will help you when we'll prepare our own business plan so these are we can set it of course you know our business plan will can be totally so services we can offer uh, the customer or the client or the resources is very detailed one so you don't need to be too much detailed in but at least you know the banking requirement they will ask you the uh, business plan huh? so is a website is called bplan.com so please, if you go to bplan.com, business website is a planning website that will help you. You can pick, you know, different and we can look around the business plans of any company of your choice, uh, any area of the business of your choice, you know, the business plan. Mm -hmm. So let's we'll start now. What is a business plan? Business plan is set out how the owner and the managers of a business of a business uh, intended to realize its objective without such Without such a, a plan, a business is likely to drift. So business plan serves several purposes. Enable management to think through the business is in a logical, structural way. If we don't have a plan, we don't know the way, how will, and we don't know. So plan is a set nav. It provides us guidance, you know, how we'll do, what we'll do, and when we'll do. So enable management to plot the progress against the plan. We can look around. We are against the plan or not. Uh, ensure that the both resources needed to carry out the strategies and the time when they are required to identify is a means for the making all in by the aware of the business direction. And it's an important document discussion. Uh, with the prospective investor and the lender and links into the detailed short term or the long term budgets as well. So role of business planning to set up objective for the business to ensure the business ideas can be delivered profitably, raise finances if required, what will be the sources of finances will use, help you know, control and manage the business. So that's all about the business plan role in a business. So key question a set of business plan must answers we need to what is the product? So think about in accounting business. So what sort of product we can offer? Like services. Audit, transition. Uh, uh, yes. So we can go through we are offering VAT return. Yes. We're offering yeah. business planning. So think about what you're offering your clients. Uh, 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 I, I offer them accounting, keeping, 
transition company personnel. I offer them business advice. I help them raise finance. Okay. Uh, cool. Yes. So these are your major services we are offering, yes? Yes. So we are offering to individual as well as the corporate clients as well, yes? Yes. So that can be RR. So what is the target market? What is your target market? Small and medium-sized enterprises in UK. Small and medium sized enterprises in the UK, which is quite huge market. Yes. Competitor. Do we have a competitor? We look the comp what the competitor are doing. Of course. Okay, so really in a business plan we can. Who are the customers like you all earlier mentioned? And what price we'll charge them, yes? Yes. Yeah what the cost to be produced and sell the product. We know how much will cost us, how we'll sell it, yes? Yeah. So in term of maybe we're looking the cost in term of the work, yes, we need to be spent. Of course, you know, we can look around with the market rate, break even. What is meant by break even then is no profit, no loss, yes? No loss, yes. So at, at least you make no loss, no profit. Brilliant. So we need always we need to look around for sustainability at least break even, yes? Yes. Then we can look around the margin of safety, at least you know we must sell. At least I'll meet my running expenses, yes? So investment required to launch an established business. Of course, if I want to be big office, yes. Establish, we need to launch and establish the business and finance is what type of the finance is required. So all these questions, so we need to ask how the business planning help. Provide a focus on the business ideas is really good and why. Help clarify the thoughts earlier mentioned. Provide a logical structure of thinking. Encourage business persons to focus on what the business is really about. Help test the financial viability of ideas. The plan provides something which can be used to measure the actual performance and nearly always you know, required to raise finances from outsiders. So we can discuss this limitation of planning for the start. Time is a main constraint. Constraint, what is meant by constraint? Constraint mean limitations, yes? Yes. Yeah. So we can look the constraint, the business planning process should be kept simple and focused, easy to produce our optimal um, plan on paper and the written business plan should be long enough purpose. It does not have to be like, you know, in details, yes. So we need to look around the contents of the simple business plan, where the idea come from, why it is a good idea. The key target for the business sales, profit, growth. So we want to sales, we want profit, we want grow. If well, we have ideas next within three, four, five years, what will, where we want to see ourselves in five years. Finances, market overview, main segment, market size. Yes, growth, how many thousand businesses are small, medium size, and how much market share really we want. How the business will operate, location, premises, staff, distribution method, and the cash forecast, important and trading forecast, all we need to look around. The contents of detailed business plan, we need to look around. Executive summary, we can profile of target market based on the market research. So research, we can do two types of research. One is a primary research and the secondary research. So both research are very important and what is and how it differentiate from existing product. If we have our unique selling point, USP, we need to set how we'll set it. So if we'll think about uh, accounting business, what the unique selling point can be? Well, uh, my unique selling point is that I am available to the clients at all times. 
availability at all time. Okay, brilliant. That's our unique selling point. Okay, good. Okay. Our next description and of. It. Sorry, yes. And I have a, a very good link with HMRC that I, I've, I used to work there before. So. Okay, it means you have a good knowledge how HMRC is working and you giving uh, your. Uh, and sharing your experience based on actually HMRC working practices, yes? Yes, yes. Brilliant. That's good. And competition. Honest description, competition in target market. What your strength? If we do SWOT analysis, yours, yes, as a business. Yes. So your strong areas, what your strong areas as a business are yourself? Well, my business is mainly based on my skills and experience and my knowledge of the industry. So knowledge of industry, knowledge about HMRC specific, yes? yes. Uh, qualified chartered accountant. Uh, and uh, that's your strength, yes? Financial, maybe we can look around, yes? Yes. Diverse experience uh, can speak different languages, yes? Of course, of course. So that's our strength. So when we're looking, we not use the word weakness, maybe we'll look around the area of development, yes? So yes. what what we think we need to be in accounting area of development now? Well, the, the IT, the technology is taking over. The, you have to study this. Look at the softwares that you need to use to apply, all the apps that are coming out. If you don't know them, it could be a weakness in your business. Absolutely right. So maybe we can look around more digitalize, yes? Yes, yes. Accounting and configuration with the HMRC and with the clients, and you're just in the middle man, yes? To linking, yes. linking clients to HMRC, yes? And we can, and uh, that's we that's really good. Pro protecting the ideas, how we can protect our ideas? Well, you can have like a trademark if you if you want to do that, or you you make you you brand it that people will not copy. It. Yes, so we can we can brand it, we can protect, we can register our trademark. And uh, of course, you know, we can protect the idea. We can register the legal contents. We have no one else can use our, our standard. Okay, crucial areas who is involved, startup, and what will they be doing? So if we have a workers, uh, I'm not sure. Are you using any apprentices? Yes, I use apprentices and I have other staff as well. Okay, brilliant. So that's really we need to. So key marketing elements, marketing mix, where we market our business. <laughs> Most of my marketing is done by my clients. I have referrals continuously since I, I, I I've been I've been in business since 1995, and I've never marketed. I've never done any leaflet, any advert. But I've gone from one client to nearly 500 clients. Okay, brilliant. So your more is a relationship marketing, yes? Yes. So maybe if we want to expand it, yes? Yes. Yeah. So maybe we can think about other source of, yes? Have you tried Yellow Pages? Gum opened up. So the first time I, that was oh, it, it, it never worked for me. You know, it never accounting, worked. accounting is like hairdressing. Hairdressing, people come to you because they know you can do it and they like your style of work. Okay, what about gum tree? Well, some people use it, but I've, not, I've never used it. Social media? Maybe well, we I've, can. I've, maybe, I've maybe got, we I've can. Got a I've got a page for my for my practice in Facebook. 
Okay, that's that's we can use effectively. So maybe we can link you know the client feedback there. So that will help you know. Reviews. Okay, great. So production upgrade. Explain what involved in the production processes. What capacity is needed? Who supp will supply with? Will record it. So like you already mentioned, and financial projections. So we do pro financial pro projections. We want every year 10% increase, 5% increase at least. Yes. yes. Financial yes. projections is work for us. It's, it's work for me. <laughs> okay, brilliant. So we always we need to look around the financial projections and we need to measure it. Yes. We are we project it, what we forecast it, are we are on the right track or not? Funding requirement. So a lot of funding from the government on the apprentices, so we can claim it, yes. So a lot of, you know, boosting skills, local people are uh, helping them to uh, link with the job center that can help us. So strategies, we can look around different strategies or action plan. Okay, so link business to the business plan. We need to always monitor unit and managerial performance forecast like assist you know cost control so we need to look around functional area and cost control preparing business plan how to be uh, particularly organization in question situation and time always we need to look around the sort analysis opportunities and threats what sort of we have how we'll tackle them and what strategies we can use them or we can totally differentiate ourselves from because maybe we have more ethnic clients or maybe we looking different segment of business or we are offering the small and medium size so we can approach to and we can offer them different advice. Okay, preparing budget. Yes, of course we need to prepare the budget. We need to look around the cash, profit and working capital for a business. So all in the business plan we can show as well. Okay finance we want for the business to run. I'm not going through slide, but this is all come under 4.1. We can discuss. Any question? No, no. Maybe a little plan we can show in our assignment as well. Yes. So we can explain and we can pick you know, the B from B plan. Okay, so develop a marketing plan for new business. So we can prepare the marketing plan. First, we can little introduction, market analysis, market needs, market size, target audience, purchase, uh, buyer purchase criteria, competitor analysis, source of, com can we say source of competitive advantage do we have? Well, it depends on the business you are in. If you are, like in a county, you you, you, your 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 advantage is your location. If you are near to a trading trading estate, and if you can have them as a client, that could be mm -hmm. a competitive advantage. Yes, that can be. Or uh, I'm thinking maybe sometime we need to look around more closely work. Like you know, sometimes some account and hitting like uh, different taxi drivers bases uh, and offer them packages and then have anybody can sign there that can be we can because we have a different strategy that can be advantage because we are very close with them uh, in terms of location as well sales strategy and pricing policy we can deliver and support and marketing communication strategies market launch plan and implementation plan. So when we are making any marketing plan, we always look, need to look around the mission. We need to look around the corporate objective as an organization. We need to do the marketing audit. We need to do SWOT analysis, exemption, marketing objective and strategies, estimate expected result, identify alternative plans and mixture. And these are the steps we can in the marketing planning process which we can go through 
so we already discussed this in one of your other unit as well so as the mission to be best value retailer exceeding so whenever they is making marketing plan they need to be focused on this their mission statement in the same way in a tesco they need to focus on their mission statement as well so we not supposed to be um, contradict with our missions and objective of organization when we making the marketing plan so on under marketing plan this is generally covered for planning definition of corporate mission we can discuss about the strategic business unit if we have uh, assign resources to each business uh, unit and then the growth opportunities we define a business mission swot analysis goal formation and strategic formation we can look around the program formations we can and the feedback and control so very crucial is the control you plan but there is a no control financial projection and our costing our client satisfaction so do we using the software to get the record the client satisfaction how will measure the client satisfaction yeah sometimes we just, we, we just we, no we, we we talk to the we have like one to one meeting mm -hmm. with the client to find out what what, what the, they think for for the sake of if you want yourself to be have you used the google form google form yes no okay do you have a gmail account we can create gmail account yes yes i've got a gmail account yes okay i quickly show you which is quite good tool you know to use for uh, because it's a control purposes it's quite good so when we we'll click here you log on gmail click here this little button yes these three so if you carry on moving around and if you go more and go further more and that template will open huh? Yeah. So you can use this for your clients, huh? So if we'll go down, 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 and you will find here it's called forms. You will see this is there forms, yes. When you click there, when you click there, and the reason I'm telling you is help your business, and this is link for weekend. If we'll go go form, yes. And I already created some forms, yes. So if yeah. I look for those some forms I created for customer satisfaction or research purposes as well. So we can use this form. Mm, I can open any form first, suppose. Um, okay, let's assume I am using this form. And uh, you want, you know, are you happy with the service? Yes. You can you can create question you can create question yourself. This is the plus sign there. Yes. Okay. Are you happy with the service? Yes. You can pick multiple choice or liquid scales. Yes. These boxes, and you say yes or no. Yes. And what you can do when you prepare it, everything you prepared. Yes. So what you can do, you can share this to. And you can send to anyone. If I want to send this, I can type my client's email there. I can send this form, and they get the form, and they can answer. When they answer, all responses will be recorded here. So you will see there. That's the responses, and what you can do, and responses you can find. You know how many people? Yes. Yeah. So we can pick. You know, are we? Is it? Are we increasing? I. So ten people, ten my clients gave me uh, a response, and out of ten, they are saying they um between between are uh, they suggesting me something new. So that's form we can use it, and that's really good. You know, it's absolutely free as well. Okay, uh, that's feedback and control. Yes, we can do through this. Any question? No, no, no. 
Okay, next is our assessment uh, criteria is develop, control, and monitor mechanism to business plan. So, control can be financial control. We can look around, we can use various ratio analysis or various other controls, variance, budgeted, and actual. That can be audit. We can do audit for the control, we can produce reports, we can look around against budget. And for the control purposes, we must need to show we are political, economic, social, or technological in terms of uh, maybe legislation change, funding change, and anything. So that's we need to. If we are looking the marketing planning control, maybe we need to look around the four P's: product, price, promotion, and place. So if this change is all, we need to be change ourselves as well. So next we're looking according to the long cost, we need to look around the information on the past performance for the control, information on the current market position. We need to and information on the likely future trends and changes. So that's come under marketing. We can as well. Okay, next when we have a planning, corporate planning, divisional planning, business planning, and product planning implementation and the control control can be mirroring the result and diagnosing the result and taking corrective action so all come according to the Kotler we can use the control any question no that's okay okay next we're looking the strategic it's called strategic windows and marketing planning According to the Tony and various other authors, the business behind the concept of strategic window, there is only limited period during which fit between the key requirement of market and competency. So maybe we need to look around what is competency we have, if fit with the market or not as a control purposes, and we can identify. So that strategic window will help us. Marketing plan, identify the opportunities and threats we need to in the strategic window control analyze all the relevant internal and external environmental factors which we discuss in marketing as well determine the best strategies and ensure adequate resources available if we don't have we can't achieve our marketing objective implement the chosen strategy to take the best advantages of opportunity presented we're saying business is growing. We need to make sure we'll get it, you know, fair shares and minimize our risks, you know. So we need to make sure we'll minimize the risk, which we can through keeping good record keeping. In terms of, have you watched the video yesterday on BBC about uh, wet issues? No, I didn't watch that. Uh, One or two. Uh, yes, basically what's happened, you know, there's a few big backs is the HMRC investigating in terms oh, of yeah, it. I, I, I saw that, yeah, I saw that one, I saw that. Uh, yes, it's, so it's, that's, it's, that's... It is bad. And so, uh, for the control purposes, so maybe we'll look, you know, after these, these incidents, so what control we can in place in our organization to protect our reputation, our... Goodwill external analysis, we can look around, yes. So thus we can depend upon the nature of the business. Then maybe we can think about, investigate and explore how the marketing planning in your organization relate to our strategic planning. Note on the key points are the area of improvement, depends the nature of the business again. Yes, so what we plan, how we can improve it in terms of marketing mix, maybe we can look around product, price, promotion, and place, point of view, and we can, so thus we can look around, maybe we can think we need to be more packages we need to offer, we need to look around the promotion in different channels to be improve our market shares than we want. So just it five points of action plan, identify opportunities and threat posed by opening and closing, we can look around, analyze the relevant internal and external environment to you, what's the happening, determine the best strategies and set strategies that like uh, likely to enable the organization to take best advantage, ensure that the adequate resources are available, 
and implement the chosen strategy. So always we need to look around according to the Tony. Okay, the marketing planning we earlier said is a process of consistent number of stages and key output is being developed coherent marketing plan to support the overall organization strategy. So key planning questions we need to be answered in. We always need to be written plan and plan selection scheduling of activity to support organization to achieve its goal. Okay, strategies and marketing according to the job which we already discussed in one of other unit as well, both internal and external environment capabilities and competencies in regular need to be reviewed. So we have a best control in place in our organization. So according to the David Jobber, we need to be asked the question, where are we now? The control, factual statement, value judgment, and success again, the expectation. So where we are now? How do we get here? Analyze the significant even contribution to achievement and shortcoming, which we have where we are heading. Focus on future, assuming we carry on before. What are the likely outcome and compare predictions of future with explorations? Do the explorations match with the prediction? If not, we may need to be changed organization behavior. And how do we get there? Opportunities for creativity. We need to be think about in accounting creative, not creative accounting. What do you think about creative accounting? Well, you have to you have, you have, you have to do you have to do the right thing with within the law. And within the law, yes, creative accounting. Lot of argument. A new standard will protect the creative accounting, but this carry on happening. Okay, so identify options, decide the course of action, and provide us with strategy. Are we are on course? We can check periodically check our position because we plan we want to 10% growth are we growing every quarter we can maybe do the quarterly monthly return if we are on course plan the remain unchanged if not then plan needs to be modified okay this is all about the marketing business mission marketing audit SWOT marketing objective course strategy target market competitive advantage competitor targets we can focus and we can prepare and the control is one of the crucial thing that can be linked with the plan okay so when we look in the marketing planning at product level so we can look around the market plan at the product level is imposed by core strategies marketing mix and always you know we need to look around the micro and macro environment both and SWOT analysis, strength, weaknesses, opportunities, and threads. We need to marketing audit. Uh, of course, we need to look around the existing marketing system. Strength and weaknesses at the court lay defined. We need to be comprehensive, systematic, independent, and periodic examination of a company environment, objectives, strategies, activities to determine the problem areas, opportunities, and recommend a plan of action to improve the company's marketing. So marketing audit has two external analysis and we can do internal analysis that will help you know to organization to achieve our objective. Any question? No, that's okay. So that's really we need to be focused. Internal marketing audit, we need to. So internal marketing audit, we need inbound logistic operations, outbound logistic sales and marketing after sales service and support of IT. How effectively we are attending the, if we have a client's problem, how quickly we can respond and any other issues we have to tackle it yes so that's all about we have today which is our cover our learning outcome four so again if we want to quick look at just marketing plan so we can go back to b plans yes yes so thus we can pick the marketing plan which we can discuss you know in our assignment as well because that's all simple plan if you want i have a template so I can send you the template. This is the marketing plan template. 
So yes, maybe we can we can write a little bit analysis. Maybe we'll say market analysis. Yes, in a term of accounting, what the customer needs size. If you your target audience. Yes. So maybe a lot of things there we can delete. It's not mean everything we must complete an analysis. We say your competitors. Yes. We can look around the competitive advantage which we have. Product definition, service, sales, delivery. Sports communication strategies, marketing plan implementation. Yeah, so that's yeah. all about the marketing plan template that will help us to make the marketing plan, which we can copy and paste in our, or we can download any marketing plan and we copy. We can little bit define and explain that will help to address our learning outcome. Any question? Oh, that's okay. So today lesson we just cover. Yes. And if we look back to, we almost, you know, the cover all because the lesson one was already recorded uh, and we were learning outcome one. Last lesson, we discussed learning outcome two and three, and today we discuss four. So it means our how learning outcome met. If you have any question between these, I can send you stuff and we can, uh, of course, you know, end of the day, we have to prepare our assignment. On the, on the, on the site on Moodle, I can't yes. see the assignment. I can't see any assignment for this module. Okay, if we go back to, if we look here. Uh, okay, yes, you're right. You know, it's nothing there. I'll ask you know Raman to ask you know from uh, OTHM if they not send us, so we'll upload you. Know. Okay. So what I'll do next lesson when we'll start in maybe new unit. So I'll pick you now and we'll go through the assignment brief as well. Huh? Okay, okay, please. Uh, yes, sure. And uh, any other question? No, that's okay, that's okay. Brilliant, so thanks sir and have a nice time. So I hope so I'll speak you some point. Huh? Okay, you said you send me the assign my assignment, the one you've uh, assessed. 